how to hide root in all apps in the latest magisk 24.1 and avoid all this problem in this video we will take sbi banking app as an example and as you can see it detects root right away so for the solution let's launch the magisk app and navigate to the setting and there you make sure that these two options are enabled next go to the enforce deny list and add the target app which is the sbi app now let's test if the solution is working or not launch the sbi app and as you can see it's still detecting but don't worry because i have the ultimate solution to this problem so to make this hack work copy the link from the pinned comment and paste it in your browser and this will open up in telegram app to make sure that you have downloaded telegram app in your hand it will open up an official ls post channel and there you have to download the samico zip file and then copy and paste it to the location in your internal storage which will be easier for you to navigate for me it's the download folder as i keep all the downloaded zip file in that folder only now let's paste the zip file into the folder but make sure to take a note of the time so once you are done next launch the magisk manager app and navigate to the module section and then to install from storage option now navigate into your internal storage where you have placed the zip file which you have downloaded from the telegram as you can see this is the zip file downloaded from telegram and which i can identify from the timestamp just click on it in order to flash the file once the file is flashed just reboot your device to apply the changes after your device boots up launch the magisk manager app and navigate to the module section and the shamiko module should appear in the list yes the module is appearing in the module list and it says that shamiko doesn't work since enforce deny list is enabled so in order for this app to work you need to deny and disable the enforce deny list you can do by going to setting scroll down and there you will find the option just click on it in order to disable it next to make it literally impossible to detect root let's do the final step by hiding the magisk manager app in the setting option only you will find an option to hide the magisk manager app just click on it click on hide the magisk app and it will ask to change the name rename it to anything you want and for me it will be tech junkie the hiding process will start and it will take a while so meanwhile like this video and subscribe to my channel as it will motivate me to make more videos like this so getting back to the video after the hiding process is over it will ask to install the app just click on install and next install anyway on the next window you will find a pop up asking send app for scanning just click on don't send next a pop up will appear on your screen asking to add home shortcut just click on okay this action will remove the actual magisk app and create a shortcut with a different package name of magisk as you can see on the video the shortcut is created next launch the shortcut and you will notice that the package name has been changed you can check it by yourself by going into your magisk app and check the package name once everything is done navigate to the deny list by going into the setting let's go to the configured deny list and add a list of application which i'm showing first and foremost you need to add the targeted application which is the sbi banking app on the top right corner click on the three dot icon show system apps from the list you need to search for two application the first is the google play store and the second is google play services Please carefully watch these steps as this is very crucial for the hack to work. Click on the Google Play services and enable these two option only. The first option and the third option from the last. Next enable Google Play Store. So once you have enabled all these options, so I'll go back into my configured deny list and show you the list of application one last time so that to make sure that you haven't missed any point i believe you have followed the video and you have enabled three application which is the google play store google play services and the targeted app which is the yono sbi app so finally let's launch the yono sbi banking app and check if the hack is working or not so as you can see we have successfully bypassed root detection in sbi banking app the same way you can hide root in any application finally let's check the safety net status Let's click on check now and you will see the safety net is passed for my device but if it fails for you check my other video